Good morning guys and welcome to the balcony of Europe in Spain or Balcon de Europa uh, as, as it is actually named. We are um, at the balcony of Europe just outside Nerja in Spain or just outside Nerja in Spain, just in Nerja in Spain. Um, it is this place right behind me up here um, it's it's like a real cool kind of viewpoint that looks out over the sea um, and you can kind of see the sunrise coming from from the other direction over here um, in this big beach area behind me uh, right now it's like 7 7 45 in the morning something like that um, I got up really early got up about 6 30 this morning um, and drove down here to try to get a nice um, sunrise shot now so often with landscapes when I got here there wasn't really that much in terms of a landscape that I thought was really going to work um, certainly in order to try to capture the sunrise anyway but then I found some cool kind of arches actually not like out on the balcony of Europe but further back down and my idea was to try to get like a cool kind of sunrisey thing through the arches um, so I'll show you where those arches are in a second first of all let's give you a look at the balcony of Europe because it is pretty spectacular go check it out guys I hope you like some of that drone footage I'm getting a bit of practicing with the Mavic Air um, I'm a real real beginner with drones so certainly no expert but I'm sure my effort my best possible effort at seven o'clock in the morning I'm sure that deserves a like on the video so go hit that thumbs up right there show me you enjoy the video show me you enjoy the footage and please don't forget to subscribe if you are new loads of sports photography stuff on my channel some landscape stuff too here and there um, but loads of sports photography stuff and then just generally talking kind of gear and tips and all sorts of like that so please do consider subscribing if you've only just found the channel so gonna go and try and take this photo uh, first of all let me go up and show you the arches um, and then we'll look at the actual kind of setup of the photo I think you kind of get the gist of how it looks so because of the way I'm going to take the photo the front of those arches is is white and of course with the sunlight coming through from behind it's going to mean if I expose for either one of the two I'm either going to have the white of the arches uh, real dark in shadow or I'm going to have the sky in the background really blown out so I'm going to have to try and do this with some multiple exposures where I expose um, a brighter exposure to get the white um, of the um, of, of the actual arches themselves and then a much darker exposure um, where I'll do that to try and capture the sunlight coming through it might actually be that I need kind of three frames for this and then I will stack them together um, afterwards in Lightroom show how they come out I'm going to use a, a fairly high um, uh, f-stop for this um, probably like f9 something like that to make sure I get all of the um, the balcony in focus or all of the arches in focus anyway I've also just spotted whilst I've been sitting here filming this piece I've also just spotted like these rocks um, you can kind of see these rocks like, like like down here behind me and, and what I'm thinking is actually where the sea is kind of splashing up like through these rocks down here below me I reckon I could do like a cool kind of long exposure looking at the waves between the rocks where the sunlight hits one side of the rocks so I'm gonna try that as well I probably won't kind of film myself doing any of that so um, if it worked I'm gonna put the photo at the end if you don't see the photo at the end that probably means it didn't work so rewind a little bit don't watch this part of the video and then come back to us later
photos are all taken guys and I think it worked out all right I'm going to include the photos at the end of the video so please make sure you stick around to check those out that's about it for today like I said shorter video had to get up so early this morning but it was worth it hopefully to get some of these cool photos and the other thing that's worth it the balcony of Europe here right this was we came through here not last night the night before and it was packed I'm talking like hundred probably thousands of people walking around so it's so cool to walk through something like that when it's just totally empty um, and that's one of the amazing things that I've learned about getting up early and doing these kind of photos I'm, I'm not a morning person right but like a by a stretch it's I'm, I'm awful at it but to get up early drive here in the dark walk out through here this morning with no one there there was one guy like cleaning some floors it's so cool because you never get to see that right I've done that in quite a few of the places I did that in Venice um, I did that in Rome and and you just you would never ever see those sites empty apart from maybe like one other photographer who's got the same idea unless you do that at that time in the morning so that's probably the best thing about doing this aside from the photography right right now I'm gonna go sleep for another like hour and a half before we get up and go do some family stuff at the pool or whatever else I hope you guys enjoyed the video as I said please hit that thumbs up button if you did don't forget to subscribe if you are new and I'm gonna see you guys with another sports photography video in the next few days see you later guys thanks for watching